Good evening. Sentencing day for a Pennsylvania furnace man convicted of supplying heroin to a woman who later died from an overdose. But the story here is the parents of the victim with an unexpected request for the judge. Lauren Hensley is in the Center County Newsroom with the details. Lauren? Marty, there wasn't a single dry eye in court today as Ryan Kemp learned his fate after the heroin he supplied Elizabeth Smeltzer with killed her back in January. Now, Elizabeth's parents, they were there in court today and they were asking the court for leniency. Many friends and family members of Lizzie Smeltzer spoke in court on behalf of Ryan Kemp. The, the sentencing standards say that someone convicted with drug delivery resulting in death would be 5 to 15 years. Both Smeltzer's mother and father said in court they would rather see Kemp in rehab than behind bars. The judge sentenced Kemp 4 to 12 years. We had hoped for a little less, but I think the judge felt that that was the minimum he could give and that he heard what we had to say, that uh, we weren't interested in any kind of revenge or punishment, that we felt like Ryan was an addict and he needed to be treated like an addict and, uh, and receive treatment rather than a long sentence. The prosecution argued that this is a sad case, but it could have all been prevented, and they believe Kemp was alone responsible for Lizzie's death. Now, several days after Lizzie's death, the Smeltzers did reach out to the Kemp family in a letter. They stated they didn't want to see Ryan Kemp punished, and we're going to share details of that letter with you coming up at 11. Reporting live, Lauren Hensley, 6 News.